We are here at our construction site for Mati Category 3 Landfill Facility required by the DNR to properly manage the residual waste of the city. And this is a mandatory facility for all LGUs. And this design is Category 3. Category 3 design requires uh, an HDPE liner or high density polyethylene liner so that there will be uh, proper protection of uh, the groundwater from the pollutant called the shade. So, Mati Sanitary Landfill coming up. Ando bita karon sa pagtaod sa ato ang CP liner, no? Using the bit welder nato og atong stroder. So hopefully matapos-tapos na rin natin ito by the end of July. Mga 85% na yung accomplishment natin as a whole. Dapat uh, maayos na itong lahat at saka magamit na rin sa ating uh, LGA itong uh, facility na ito uh, for the sake of the uh, public. We at Ridge to Reef, we are capable of installing the high density polyethylene liner. We don't have to ask uh, people from Manila or Cebu to do it for us, but uh, for all the projects that we are undertaking, we are the ones doing the installations ourselves. So in Ridge to Reef, we can really assure that uh, once you have uh, HDPE requirements, so we will uh, purchase uh, the HDPE directly from the supplier and then after that we plug and play everything. Here we are already uh, around 85% complete uh, in our overall uh, target and we just uh, have to uh, complete the installations of all these HDPE liners which can be done easily given that we have all the technical capacity and capability for it to be uh, installed. So after that, uh, the LGU can already utilize the facility for its actual waste disposal. <music> 